Hi, I'm Tim Overhill with Barrett Firearms. We're here today to give you a brief tutorial about your new Barrett rifle. Uh, this is aimed at those who have a severe allergy to owner's manuals. This is just enough to get you to get the gun out of the box, get it together, get you on your way to the range. Okay, right now we're working with the Model 98B. It's a 338 Lapua Magnum fed by a 10 round detachable box magazine. Uh, before we start, as we would with any other firearm, we're going to make sure that's unloaded, pulling the bolt to the rear, and doing a physical and visual inspection of the chamber area to make sure there's no ammunition in the gun. Magazines easily removed by pressing on the ambidextrous magazine release. The magazine will drop straight down and out. Being a bolt action, it's a very simple gun to operate and maintain. The upper receiver hinges away from the lower receiver, just like, like a M4 or a FAL type rifle. And the way we do that is by pressing on the takedown catch back here. That's about an inch or two behind the pistol grip area. And the trick we found at the factory is that while pushing in on the catch, if you just slap the butt end of the rifle, the, uh, the two will hinge apart. Okay, once you've broken the rifle in half, removal of the bolt assembly is a piece of cake. You just pull it to the rear, and it should slide out with the polymer bolt guide. Uh, separating the polymer bolt guide from the bolt, just grasp the bolt guide and slide the bolt right out. This way you can access the bolt for lubrication, cleaning, and maintenance. You can separate completely the upper from the lower by knocking out the front hinge pin, um, but you can actually clean it and maintain it for the most part the way it is right now. We always recommend that you clean a precision rifle for the breech end of the barrel versus the muzzle. The cleaning rod could actually damage the rifling, the lands and grooves, which would negatively impact your accuracy. So always clean your Barrett rifle from the back end. The other thing that we can do here at this point, we can take out the fire control group. Uh, unlike other precision rifles, uh, the Barrett does not need to come back to the factory. It's uh, completely adjustable by the end user. The way we take that out is by rotating the safety switch halfway between uh, fire and safe and using a pen or a punch, push it through from the right hand side, uh, wiggling it back and forth usually helps. And then the safety lever just pops right out. Once you've done that, you can grasp the top of the fire control group, rotate it back and out. Now you can see the adjustment points to adjust your, your trigger pull weight and length of pull as per the directions in the Barrett owner's manual. Reassembly is the exact opposite, just insert it, rotate it forward, set the line up the holes in the trigger pack with the hole in the receiver, and reinsert the safety switch. Now just keep in mind that there's a detent which retains the safety selector lever. That's going to have to be pushed down for reassembly. A pen or a punch comes in handy for that, and just wiggle the lever back and forth until it pops back in place. And it should rotate back and forth freely. So once you've cleaned out your fire control group parts, you've scrubbed out your barrel and your receiver, you've scrubbed the bolt face and the bolt locking lugs with a, with a brush, you've re-lubricated, and you want to reassemble the rifle, just slide the bolt back into the polymer bolt guide. There's only one way you can do it, it's closed on the one end. And just slide the assembly back into the upper receiver. And when that's done, just hinge the two halves back together, and it'll latch closed. Do a function check, once again, make sure that there's no ammunition in the gun, both visually and physically. Close the bolt with the safe in the safe position, pull the trigger, nothing should happen, rotate it to the fire position, you should hear the firing pin go home. A few other notes on the features on the 98 Bravo, it comes with a fully adjustable cheek piece, it's ambidextrous, you can take the, uh, the adjustment knob and switch it from one side to the other depending on whether or not you're right or left handed. Just loosen that up and you can raise or lower this as needed. The monopod is also adjustable much the same way. Just loosen it up. For coarse adjustments, you can raise and lower it. And for finer adjustments, you just rotate the monopod on the thread. 
magazine, very easily inserted. You just push straight up, tap and tug, make sure that it's firmly seated. And there you have the Barrett Model 98B.